we felt like we were the better team for 40 minutes, but that's not a full hockey game. And something that we emphasize is playing a full 60 minutes, especially on the road. So, um, you know, just really, uh, uh, the, you know, fell off the track there in the third. Yeah, the third period defensively, that just wasn't what you, how you guys had been the last month or so, basically. No, and you give their their guys too much time and space, and um, they made us pay. We were all game, focusing on playing well with the puck and, and managing it well, and in the third period, we didn't do that. So uh, it's just um, it, was a, it was a breakdown, total, total team breakdown, and, and uh, you know something that we're going to look at. It's not us, and something we're going to look at before we go into Vancouver. Six points for McDavid. Did you just see him elevate his game in the third period, or how did you see that in that third period? I just thought we gave him too much time and space, and, and uh, he uh, he took over, and you know, he's the best in the world. So uh, that's how I saw it. Just way too much time and space, um, too much time with the puck. Obviously, that early goal in the third. You guys must have felt good going into that period the way you were playing, but that early goal was kind of deflating. Yeah, we, we felt good. I, I don't, the first one's no big deal. Um, you know, they score two quick ones. We're still fine. It's just, um, you know, we the power play, we went over the boards and have a chance to make it a game, and, and um, I mean, we didn't. The power play was great for us tonight, but um, when we needed it, it uh, we didn't get the, the goal we needed. Is that the message to this group after this game, is just playing the full 60 heading into the rest of this road trip? Well, it's a message for our team. Every game is, is you have to do that in this league especially on the road, especially against a team like that. So um, you could see it last game against Vancouver crept in and, and we had a, not a great second period, but, uh, you know, it kind of, it, it very much caught up to us tonight and something that we need to address quickly. And, uh, you know, we're, we're going into to Vancouver on Thursday and, and uh, needs to be a little uh, look in the mirror uh, from everyone and, and uh and, and we need to bring our A game. We actually the type of defensive game that you guys have been playing here lately. Yeah, I think um, we just really lost it in the third, which is really disappointing. I thought um, up to that point, I thought we had better chances. We're, we're kind of rolling. And um, in the end, it's a really devastating result um, with a lot of mistakes we got to correct. It's still a, a long road trip, and hopefully we can really um, flip the switch here pretty quick. Dylan made a point too. Did you guys kind of see it seep in a little bit in that Vancouver game too, a little bit Saturday in that second period? I mean, is that something you guys got to nip in the bud here pretty quick? Uh, yeah, it's um, pretty obvious. Uh, obvious when you uh, do those kind of mistakes against uh, the top players in the world, um, they they make you pay for it. And definitely, we learned our lesson today. How about facing McDavid? He had six assists tonight. Did you see? Anything? I mean, what was it like facing him tonight? Um, kind of like every every night. I mean, he's really dominant. Um, I think today he got the better of us, um, which is really frustrating because I, I thought at that point we did a pretty solid job um, of containing him. I um, just got to be honest with myself. I think we, we got to be better. Uh, I got to be better, and then, um, well, we'll go from there. Um, but obviously... Uh, really frustrating right now. When he starts rolling like that, when he starts playing the way he plays, how tough is it to kind of just stay with him and try and contain him? Uh, really hard, but that shouldn't be any excuse. Um, we got also five guys on the ice, um, and we got to play as a unit, and we didn't do that. And then he'll definitely find ways to expose you. A couple power play goals in tonight. That power play is clicking right now. It was clicking tonight, obviously. Yeah, uh, I think we came in with, with a really solid game plan. Um, they... Uh, they usually don't take a lot of penalties, and um, they're kind of struggling. So we we had to take advantage, um, but um, that's definitely something positive to take away from that game. You guys got it right back to yeah. where you wanted, and then what happened? Very you frustrating. That well, it's a little un unfortunate. A little trickle down effect. Uh, Wally uh, blew a tire there, uh, lost an edge, and he goes and changes. And we had no outlet. Everyone changed. We had no trickle effect. Unfortunately, we didn't handle very well. And again, um, just an easy goal for them. Um, so it's going to be a frustrating game to watch back because we did a lot of good things um, 
to get a game like that to 3-3, three, three, uh, to let it slip away, a little frustrating. Just bottom line is too much easy offense, not a lot of it, but too much easy offense for a team that doesn't need an easy offense. And unfortunately, you know, unlike our previous six weeks, you know, our outstanding goaltending uh, in that time didn't bail us out tonight. Speaking of which, okay, right, who so? I mean, was that just re, re Yeah, I don't something? know if it was the same injury, but it's a lower body injury. Unfortunately, he hurt himself previous to the goal, uh, hence him not being able to move laterally on the goal. Um, it was very unfortunate uh, uh, for him, especially he's fought really hard and uh, worked hard to get back to this point. So, uh, going to be a setback again. We'll know a little bit more uh, probably tomorrow, but uh, it feels uh, very similar, uh, you know, to his previous injury there. A couple of guys mentioned it before, and you kind of alluded to it. Just it just wasn't you guys in the third period. No, it was not. You have been At five lately. three, especially because it wasn't us in the first two periods. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, you're going to look back on that second period. It was probably one of the more lopsided periods we've had. Um, you know, we, got, we had a 12-3, chances four in a second. Unfortunately, uh, we got a little unlucky uh, with some goal posts and some crossbars, and uh, we don't get out of it with the lead, uh, but just, just a little disappointing. We didn't handle it managing it very well in the third. You gave it at six points tonight. Is that just a guy elevating his game, or is that? Yeah, no, I think it was a little bit of both. One, probably a little bit of elevation, but again, it was just it's, it was too easy for him. We would have we we will take what we did against him for two periods, and then he gets feeling a little bit. Uh, our compete drops off just enough. You can see a little more sag of some gaps, um, some turnovers. Uh, we're not at the top of our game, and that's probably my point. It was a little too easy you know, for him, but. And we made it easy on him. Powerfully finding the back then a couple times tonight. Yep. Pleased with that performance. Yeah, two for three, of course. You, you're going to need your power play going. You need everything going. And it got us back in the game in the first, and obviously got us back in the game in the second. Um, so that was a good sign. Elena with his test, 10 guys with at least 10 goals. That's kind of the depth that you've been talking 100%. about. 100%. Yeah. And it's great, and it's why we're in this fight right now. Um, and we're going to continue to need it down the stretch. So, again, very disappointing tonight in the fact that it was sitting there for us. Uh, there's nights you could come in here and play well against a team like that and not get an outcome. Uh, this game was there uh, with some opportunity. Uh, took them late into the third uh, to get their game in order, and, and unfortunately it just kind of felt like we fueled it. Hey, Derek, did you kind of notice some of that defensive stuff seep in maybe a little bit in that Vancouver game? Is it something that's no. got to nip it up? No, we, nip we gave it in the bud here pretty five, cool. five on five chances against Vancouver. Okay. It was yeah. maybe one yeah. of our best defensive games of the year. A lot of their looks late yeah. came on their two power plays, which is world class. So, no, I, so, um, but tonight, unfortunately, we were just, we were a little soft uh, around our net. And again, just a little too easy for them on a team that doesn't need it. Thanks, Susie. Yeah.